It is um, 0815, quarter past eight this morning. And if there's one thing about the UIM, barring any other party, it seems like we're on time. So um, I just want to welcome everybody quickly and my apology that we had to call a urgent uh, live broadcast. And obviously after this, I will be issuing a national press statement as the president of the United Independent Morn uh, Moment. Morning, moment. Goeiemorgen allemaal, jammer die oogsikkel nog een beetje om te lees. So, ek wil net vir hulle sê, baie, baie goeiemorgen uh, aan allemaal op Facebook, aan elke UIM supporter en ook my Facebook vriende. Dit is fantastisch om vir een slag my oog oop te hee en soos julle kan sien, vandag is die eerste dag sonder die klap, hy sikkel nog een beetje, maar uh, dit is vir my die Heerse geneesing en een ongelooflike hand van God oor my, dat gister ek... Um, verklaar is dat my oog 100% suksesvol was met die operatie. Ek wil net vir elkeen van u sê, baie dankie vir u gebede, baie dankie vir u oproepe, en in teendeel vir al die liefde en vir al die support. Ons kan nie veel sê hoeveel der duisende e-posse en Facebook boodskap ek gekry het saam met my span nie. Vir dit, baie dankie en ek waardeer dit en, en amal van ons hier by die UIM familie. I want to thank everyone before I start to say thank you very much to my family, my staff, Sydney that stood with me every single day, Mark and all the guys in my team, Boerland, for standing with us in this time that I had to rest the eye. But as you can see, I am back. I'd like to address two matters today with yourself, which is important, but tomorrow I will continue again with a normal slot of the State of the Nation, according to Neil, at nine o'clock tomorrow. I would also like to thank every individual in South Africa, the more than 8,000 people that have now decided that the UIM is their home. I will for elke een van die meer as 8,000 mense vandag sê, baie dankie, dat jylle besluit het dat die UIM is jylle huis. Since we launched two weeks ago, the applications of trying to get as many of you to email membership at uimsa.org, we have been flooded with a miracle of a tidal wave tsunami of change. Ons het twee weke gelede gevra dat as die belang stel om ons te support om by ons te staan met de nieuwe era, stuur asjeblief jylle details na membership at uimsa.org en ons het weer eens een tsunami gehad en ons vra dat die anhou daarmee. Ek sal morgen negen hier, nadat ons begin het met ons conferentie, wat ek nou met u sal bespreek, dat ons dan een uh, media uh, besluit gaan neem, en dat ek dan sal opklim op negen hier, en een besluit vir u gee oor die lidmaatskap en hoe dit gaan werk. Our target is that by the end of March to stand on 20,000 members. And this can be achieved if everybody just on my Facebook sends your message so that we can get back to you to apply. And that is the start of the change. Wil ek net sê, amal wat op Koela was, amal wat op RSG vir my geluister het, en die honderde boodskap het daarna, baie dankie. It is important today though, that I take this opportunity as been requested by my executive, that I make a statement regarding yesterday's press release and media release of 1SA, OSA and Musi Maiman. I must apologize that we did not prepare and that we did not send out a following briefing, either in support or highlighting certain very critical issues between the perceived current relationship of Neil de Beer and Musi Mayaman. In actual fact, the perceived current relationship between OSA and the UIM. And we would like to clear that matter this morning. The reason we did not send out a press release prior, or in actual fact, a press release after, is in actual fact that we were not told and that we were not updated exactly what the OSA strategy and what they were impending to do. This 
I will address no doubt with the OSA leadership as soon as tomorrow. But from our side as the UIM, we have since the inception, since the day that we saw that this country could bring independence to make a change to a country that is desperate, has fallen in the hands of politicians. I made it clear on the day that we launched last year, mid-September, August, that we are not politicians. We might be politically connected and politically understood, but we have never served in a parliament of this nation. We have never served in a council and we have never ever taken money, stood in a parliament and did nothing. And I am talking about the current government, the ANC. I am talking about the absolute non-existence of a DA through all its leadership being a so-called apprehensive opposition. Opposing what? And lastly, the EFF that were more interested in filling water bottles and wearing helmets, not as decoration, but as weapons, to disarm a parliament chamber that was supposed to be recognized as honorable. I will make it very clear that Musi Mayamani, at the point of our launch and at the point of joining us to give recognition that day, as you remember, in the press, of supporting the Bill of Independence, did not join the UIM and neither did we join OSA. There is a stringent rule from us as a council, as the UIM, and that is politicians there, we the people here. And we will remain steadfast to say that every politician, the 400 of them, that have sat for more than 27 years in a chamber, brought dishonor, brought absolute the fall of this country's integrity, and did not defend the people of this republic. Ons besef dat na 27 jaar 400 mense in ons nationale parlement daar gesit het vir hulle self. Is sal nou achterkom, ek sê 400. Want in die nationale partij is daar 400 sitplekke. Dit blijkt my die sitplekke het gebleik oor die gatte wat hulle daar deur gesit het en die leer wat hulle met hulle holle deur getrek het. Want dit is al waar hulle was in die parlementse sitplekke. Daar was meer belang gestel met blauw lichte serenes, top restaurante, hotelle en sogenaamde eterei in Indabas, as wat daar was om op die grond in Kalfinia, Oudsoring, Benoni, Brakpan, Kreesdorp en Welkom, Bloemfontein, Derman, hulle sole af te trap. So ek dink as jy een politiekus vraag om een biologische toets te doen en jy kyk na sy hande en jy kyk na sy voete, dan is het sy gat wat meeste deurgeskier is. Want daar is nie gewerk nie en daar is nie geloop tussen ons mense nie. En nou wil mense kom met hulle retoriek. Nou wil hy selle mense wat op hulle gatte gesit het in die parlement terwijl ons land brand. En nou wil hulle weer met die almoes kom klop by die hout deur en vraag dat jy vir hulle nog vijf jaar moet gee, dat hulle hulle gatte kan deersit. Zuid-Afrika, ons is toch nie mal nie? Ons is toch nie een land van idiote nie? Ons is een land, wat kom uit een meerderjarige punt van goed en sleg. Dit maak nie of jy swart of wit of indier of bruin of kleerling of kwaisaan is nie maak saak dat jy kan sien dat mense sy gatte deurgerei is in die parlement. En dit is die selfde vir local government. Dit is die selfde vir die municipaliteite. Jylle gaan weer mense aanstel. Die DA, die ANC, die EFF, die Vryheidsfront, en Kata, en wat oor is van Koup, en ons praat hier is van die klein tannikie wat rond daar loop, wat al by 7 politieke partijen was nie. Patricia, Nou hoor my lied, 
Ek is een afgetrede soldaat en het maak nie saak wat een soldaat nie. Ek is een soldaat. Ek is een hoge mens in die aanzien van die ekonomie, maar ek bly nie verstaan hierdie mense wat op hulle gatte gesit het. Want ek het van boe gekyk en altyd gesê, Oh cry the beloved country. Neel de Beer vraag nie vir die tyd nie. Ek sta nie alleen nie. En dit is my eerste afspraak wat ek met die wil maak vandag. Today, for the first time in the UIM history, the whole National Executive Council of the Management Committee will be assembling for three days. I have called them so that we can meet in the next three days. Because people that think that the UIM has not got structure, that has not worked, and does not have thousands and thousands of emails of people that don't want to join us in the sense of running for their wards, running because they don't want to have politicians in their towns anymore. And that counts for politicians or reinvented politicians or people that refurbished, reinvented, rehashed themselves. Because a duck stays a duck because he quacks like one, swims like one and is bloody feathered like one. And the only thing I see you could do with a duck today is pluk sy vere en maak a kombers of maak om dood en geef vir hom vir a Chinese restaurant. Van duck chow mein is die selle. So South Africa stop supporting ducks. En ek is jammer, totdat hem en Mishaba vir my bewys dat hy is nie meer een diapoliticus met eie ideologie van homself nie, want ek ken hom nou al vir 30 jaar. Hy was dier die dia, hulle was daar. So ek is jammer, elke persoon in politiek, as jy gekleed is, geverf is, en jy het geld gevat dier die staat, om op die bank te sit namens ons vir 27 jaar, dan sê ek vir jou, namens die UIM, en nou die der duisende wat by ons aansluit, jylle het misluk. You failed this country. And now you want to come back and say, Tata Matans, Ufuna en Mot, Engram, Op Oe Taim, Oe Kom, So Seo Belebele, Luister vir my, Vlieg in jou hel. Want jy het hel, Vir ons in hierdie land nou gebring. You brought hell on earth. It is not bad alone, That we are facing COVID. Facing this massive process, of to vaccine or not. And then to understand that we are going to go through certain BEE selective processes for people to gain currently access to vaccine. What a utter lot of rubbish. In this time, there should be no discussion. Sir Lord Ramaphosa, you are the outgoing president of this republic. Do not walk a walk of shame. The UIM stands strong. The UIM will put a minimum of 293 candidates at 293 wards in absolutely 7 to 12 metros and municipalities. And if every town in this country decides it's going to put one ward up for, for the UIM, then so be it. Because that word, that name, that voice will be the one of no lie, guided by the principles of Christ ensure that we fight crime and corruption like we are already doing. We will have our final discussion tomorrow with OSA after their press release of saying they want to now under Musi Mayamani enter local government elections because they are compelled to do so by their conscience. Well, conscience isn't grown. And suddenly created conscience is always instilled by you by the word of God. It has always been there. It's just when did you start listening to it? Well, I would like to ask every politician currently that sits in parliament and every councillor, when the hell did you grow a conscience? Suddenly, isn't it weird that just before the elections, your conscience is back? Unacceptable. And we are not going to take your lies. We are not going to take the painting of a zebra because jy kan maar a zebra borsel en verf wat ek kleer jy wil, maar as jy reen kom, is jy toch maar net weer wit en zwart. So number one, 
We will issue a press statement today, ensuring the clarity between 1SA's now total push under Musi Mayamani, ex-leader of the DA, to run for again local government election. And number two, to very much sincerely clarify the UIM stance on this absolute attack and war, this fight at the ballot box, to take this country back away from them, the politicians, and give it back to Freak and Andrei, Gordon, Jimmy, Sipo, and Yanda. Because we, the people, are qualified. Because we, the people, are the people suffering. Secondly, I would ask that you put a hand of prayer on the UIM Council's meeting now from across the country to make the right decisions and to be guided by those principles which I announced six months ago. And those are the four C's. By a makluk. Fight crime, fight corruption, redistribution and distribution of legal capital and in the body of Christ. It does not matter who you are. It does not matter where you come from. We have decided to stand. We have decided to fight the amalgamation of a country so that we can be that number one country on this continent again, not Nigeria. From the strongest economy in this country, on this continent, to not even number two or three. This is what you've done, government. Yes, and I was sitting on the outside looking in. I cannot do this anymore. I am in the fire. Want net die mense wat by die braai sit, kan reik dat Gerard die bloody chops brand. Want jy, Jakko, wat by die huis sit, jy kan net na die tyd hoor hoe Gerard die bloody chops opgedaan het. So as jy nie by die braai sit en jou branas of jou gemmer bier of jou stiel drink met jou bitters nie en jy reik nie die chop nie want Jakko is bezig om die muziek te verander dan kan jy ons nou nie weer die vleis braai en brand nie man. Ons as die UAM sit by die vleis nou ons het nou een paar mense een bykie uitgestamp en gesê gemaakt die uit gooi jy nog een branas want jy daal na die vleis op. Mense kom ons hou op om die vleis te brand man. Kom ons draai die chop as mens. En as hy politiek is en hy rooster wil vat, dan sê jy vir hom, soos hom Frikkie altyd vir my gesê, die dood draai baie links in as jy jou hand op my rooster sit, want hier donner ek jou. My braai, my braai. So ek gaan afsluit met die woorde. Politicians, take your hands off my grill, because this is my country and this is our country's future. Vat jou hande van ons land af, politiekus, want jy het al klaar hierdie vleis oor nacht getjakel, want ek weet as mense wat vleis wil eet, dat jy hom nie met die batterij kan bakker skok nie. Maar daar is ook een verskil tussen well done en gebrand, en ek reik brand. That's my statement, South Africa, today. We will continue with discussions with other groups, we will discuss our future, unfortunately, with politicians. We will have to do coalition. We will have to unite. But on the principles that I have mentioned, and we are not negotiable. For Christ, against crime, against corruption, and the redistribution of capital fairly to all, all in this country. We will be making a statement at the end of the UIM conference on Thursday morning on the resolutions taken by my council. I look forward to that press conference at 10 o'clock on Thursday morning to tell you the result of our deliberations. I hope I'm very clear that the UIM stands currently alone. Alone in a country where we are surrounded by dark, no matter what color, be it blue, Red, green, or black, yellow, and green. These are the colors chosen by the multi-partible state that have failed us. Maybe black and white is the right color. Because from darkness to light, and maybe between black and white for once, we could be like a piano. Ebony and ivory. So it's together in harmony.
God bless South Africa. God bless the Republic. And God bless the people of such country. Mag die Heere Suid-Afrika sien en mag die Heere sy hand sy Gods reikste sien oor die mense wees van ons land. And may the UIM and its deliberations come up with a solution that will take this country forward for all races, all color, all domination, but end the political hogwash in this country once and for all. Together, we will. Amen.